Hey guys, welcome to Tech Tricks Tutorial. Today we're going to talk about the best AI video generator free without watermark Canva AI. It's a step-by-step -step guide to follow easily and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Let's dive right in. Welcome to a new tutorial video and today I'll be showing you guys how to use the new feature of Canva which is the video generator over on its very own Magic Studio feature. So let's dive in. First things first, to navigate to Canva, you're gonna need to type in canva.com in your web browser and you'll be routed shortly into the landing page of Canva. And so over here on the upper right corner of your screen, just click the sign up button and you can easily log in with your Google, Facebook, email, or click on the other options here and you will have more options on how you can sign up with Canva. But for me personally, I'm gonna use my Google account and once you do the initial login, you'll be routed into your very own Canva homepage. So to all of you guys that hasn't used Canva yet, well Canva is an online graphic design platform that allows users to create a wide range of visual content including social media graphics, presentations, posters, documents, and more. It provides an intuitive and user-friendly interface with a variety of templates, image, icons, and design elements making it accessible to individuals with various design skill levels. So for a quick example, if you want to make a website over in Canva, just simply type in website on the search bar and you will have a lot of templates for your website project. So going back to the topic on the left side panel of my screen, I have here my shortcuts to navigate around in the platform. I have here my homepage and of course the Magic Studio, projects, templates, brands, and applications. So to access the AI video generator, we're going to actually head on to the application and over here I want you to type in Magic Media on the search bar and hit enter and click the first option. So this is actually the free video generator of Canva and as you can read the sentence it says turn your creative ideas into images and videos and I'm gonna be actually doing that later on. And by the way this application is powered by Runway and Runway is a unique interface that allows you to generate videos using text, images, or video clips. You can also generate compelling images and videos with nothing but your words. If you want to check out the website you can do so by going to runwayml.com and going back to the topic so from this section, we're going to click on used in new design and select custom size. So from here, I want to do a 16 by 9 inches. And once you're done from here, just click create new design and it's going to be sending you back to the editor of Canva. So this is the actual editor of Canva where you will be spending most of your time if you're going to be using this platform. As you can see on my screen, I have a blank Canva document for this project. And on the left side panel of the screen, you will find a set of tools that will assist you in designing and customizing your project over here. These tools include options for adding designs, elements, text, brands, uploads, draw, project, applications, and lastly, the magic media that we have just added. So this is the section where we'll be focusing for today's video. We have here the text to image section. Simply describe the image you want and magic media will generate images for you. And then we also have the text to video. Once again, simply describe a scene to generate a few seconds of video. And take note, you only get to generate 5 videos for your free subscription. However, if you like the application, you have the choice to upgrade to a premium subscription. And for the images as well, you only get to generate 50 images for your free plan. Now let me show you how you can generate an image from text using Magic Media. The instruction says, please include objects, colors, places, and more. So I'm gonna type in building made of living trees for my prompt and simply click on generate image button over here and just wait for it to load up. It might take a minute or less, but once it's done generating, you should see four images based on your text description. So I'm gonna fast forward it here, and here we go as you can see on my screen. I have four buildings made of living trees, which is what exactly I was expecting based on the prompt I give. And if you don't like these images, you can click on generate again, and it will show you another set of four images based on your prompt. Once again, wait for it to generate, and once completed, it will display another set of results for your prompt, and take note that in certain situations, you might receive only 3 or 2 images. This is due to the overwhelming demand for Magic Media breaking records with unprecedented popularity. Their system experiencing high demand and it's possible that their engine might be adjusting. But don't worry, as you can generate in a few minutes. And once you have an image that you want to use for your project, simply drag and drop it into your blank canvas and it will be added shortly. In just a few short steps, you have successfully generated an image based on your text description. It's evident how easy it is to utilize Magic Media for creating images from text. And now moving on to the text or video. So over here it's gonna be the same process but you'll just have to describe a scene. So for the first video that I'm gonna generate, I'm actually gonna try an example over here so I can show you guys a head start on how accurate and easy you can use this feature. So let's go for pop art animated background with minimal motions design static. 
and click on generate video button and once again just wait for it to load up it should be ready in one to two minutes so i'm gonna speed this up and it was actually far quicker than even one minute so here we go we have here our video that we just generated based on the description that was given as the example and to add this into your project once again simply drag and drop the video into the blank canva so as you can see in the video we have an abstract background with minimal motions designs with it similar to what we described for our scene now for the second video i'm gonna actually type in my own prompt and for this time i'm gonna stick with an example that is related to real life so that you can see how amazing and accurate this magic media is so for the prompt let's go for cars passing by the bridge while raining and once again simply click on generate video and wait for it to load up but once it's done loading up it should generate a video that was based on your description so i'm just gonna fast forward it from here and there it is we have the video that the magic media generated for us now let's take a closer look on how real this video could get once again just simply drag and drop the video into your blank canva and it will be added shortly so let's try to play the video over here as you can see in the video it was super smooth and perfect like you wouldn't be able to tell that it was an ai generated image the cars the raid is completely believable and we've got a little movement going on around also which made the video perfect the only thing that i didn't like about the video is the portion over here where the car seems to disappear going nowhere and also if you take a closer look on the cars some are facing the right way and some are facing the wrong way which totally made the video useless if you feel that the video generated doesn't seem right at all you can actually report that specific video to magic media using the section over here the reason for doing so is that magic media is a new technology and they are still evolving leaving room for mistakes by reporting the video you are also helping them to improve their production or you can actually click on generate again to generate the same scene but different visuals on your video for example i'm gonna generate again over here so that i will have a new video with the same scene i'm just gonna fast forward it from here and so as you can see we have a new generated video with the same scene let me add a blank canvas over here to put this video and let's compare the two i'm just gonna zoom it out for you guys to see the difference between the two so for the second video we have cars passing by the bridge while pouring rain this video is actually perfect based on the description that we have given below the only thing that is off in this video is the car over here backing up the wrong way i can tell that magic media is not yet totally launched there are still room for mistakes their engine is not yet developed but overall everything here seems to be real these videos could still be useful for upcoming projects and what's more important is this is a free application you can use here in canva i'm actually really happy that they have added this feature here in canva you can visit the website there are a lot of projects you can do in this website alone and figure things over here for yourself and with that that brings us to the end of this video i hope you learned something from this tutorial if you have any suggestions or ideas please feel free to comment down below i thank you guys so much for watching your support means a lot. I'll see you guys on my next video. Goodbye.